through Monster Hunter World is like experiencing a long-form TV show where new thrills and twists are thrown in at every turn. You'll just get used to one thing, and then the game goes, I think you can handle something else, and then gives you a sweet new mechanic to learn. It's one of the many reasons we love Monster Hunter World. At one point, you'll suddenly receive high rank content, and you'll realize the past hours of gameplay were training you for this very moment. And it's incredible. So let's talk about high rank content, how to unlock it, and why it's so damn good. Any hunter worth their salt is going to want their hands on the high rank content, as it means tougher armor, stronger weapons, and more challenging quests. Unlocking high rank content is as simple as progressing through the main story until you fight Zora Magdaros for the second time. After kicking Zora Magdaros' ass again, you will receive a quest called Invader in the Waste, and it tasks you with hunting down an odd Pookie Pookie. With this quest completed, you can return to Asteria and speak with the commander to unlock all high rank content. Things are going to get tough, so you're going to want to improve your gear. With high rank content unlocked, you can deliver a whole new world of pain to the monsters you hunt. You'll note that the previous blacked out areas of the upgrade trees is now visible, and that weapons can be improved beyond simply upgrading them. High rank weapons can now have decorations placed in them, which are little jewels that will boost specific attributes. By placing a jewel in your high rank weapon, you can raise skills up to new heights. Putting a decoration in a weapon often means a piece of armor can be swapped out. Were you relying on the attack bonus from a piece of armor? Well, with the attack jewel, you're free to swap out the armor for something else, unless you want that next tier of attack damage. Speaking of armor, high rank armor is a whole other ball game in Monster Hunter World. Did you only just get a full set of armor you liked in low rank content? Well, throw it away, because high rank armor makes it look like a limping great Jargus. High rank armor offers greater defenses, higher upgrade ranks, and most important, two different versions. The high rank armor comes in alpha and beta flavors. These two versions look different from one another, but also offer unique differences in skills, attributes, and slots. The alpha version of high rank armor has more built-in skills, but the beta version of high rank armor allows you to equip decorations. If the alpha version of the armor contains all the skills you need, then that's great. However, if you've got a decoration with better stats, beta versions will likely be your preference. Rounding up the high rank content are the high rank quests. Investigations, bounties, and optional quests now have high rank counterparts, boasting greater rewards but also greater challenges. With high rank quests unlocked, you'll note some differences with the environment and even some monsters. Monster Hunter World continues to open up, even after putting in more hours than their standard game. High rank shakes it all up, offering more armor options, deadlier weapons, more dangerous monsters, and high rank rewards from completing missions. If you thought the low rank content was incredible, just wait until you unlock the high rank content.